Welcome to the Windows and Computer Channel and today we are Wednesday, February the 24th, 2021 and Windows versions 2004, that's the May 2020 update and 20H2, that's the October 2020 update, both have updates. So that was released a little more than an hour ago. They are bug fixing updates only, so no security in here, don't worry. That means they're optional, so if you don't click on them or search for them, you won't actually have them install automatically. Um, if you have no problems in either versions, if you're on the May or October 2020 update, everything's fine, nothing's wrong, everything works like you want, then I would suggest that you probably ignore these updates since it's not really important uh, if you have nothing wrong. But if you do have problems, there's a pretty big list of fixes. It's a huge list of fixes in here. Uh, so um, if you had some little glitches here or there in Windows 10, May or October 2020 update, I think it's worth it to check that out and uh, install. Since they are, of course, optional, that means manually go to all settings, go into uh, update and security, and click that check for update button and you'll see it uh, appear and you then have to click the download and install because it won't install automatically until you click. So if you do apply them, you will actually be at 19041.844. That's on the May 2020 update. If you're on the uh, 20H2, you'll be at 19042.844. That means they are now matching the version also that insiders have for the 21H1s at the ending 844 since it's the same core of Windows basically. So like I said, a, a very big list of fixes. So anything that you feel is not right, maybe you should check this out because it might fix some of the problems. Um, you know, it's interesting to see how many problems are there, but they're not in the known issues list. Uh, so there's a much bigger list of fixes than what Microsoft actually will uh, give out usually. If you're on 1909, I think you should also just check it out if you want to move on. Maybe some of you that didn't see the May or October 2020 update could see it now since this update is here. Uh, sometimes these updates, these bug fixes will also remove something, a blocker that you might have that is unique to your computer. So on 1909, you might want to check if by chance you see the update for a more um, modern version of Windows now. For the rest, like I said, you got no problem? Well, if it ain't broke, don't fix it. I think that's pretty uh, good and applies a lot to Windows. And if you have some problems, check it out. It might fix whatever you have. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.